Today I am making pancakes and I am making fluffy pancakes so I will be using my KitchenAid but before we get started please hit that subscribe button and like. Okay, so in my bowl I will be putting a cup of flour, two tablespoons of sugar, and in this mixture, I have one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, and half a teaspoon of salt. Once we have all the ingredients together, the dry ingredients, we're gonna be stirring it. And then you want to add two tablespoons of melted butter, three quarter cup of milk, two tablespoons of white vinegar and last but not least your egg just one egg is fine and then we'll keep mixing this so what I'm going to be doing now is heating up my pan and I like to use a smaller pan because all the heat is right in here and it's just the perfect temperature to heat up that pancake or to make that pancake. And also it is a flat bottom as well so then it gets really nice and flat at the bottom and then it kind of fluffs out a little bit outside. You'll see what I mean here. So let's take out a batter and this is what it looks like. Perfect, and I have my little utensil here, <laughs> and then we'll take our pan, put it on here, take this, so you don't want it too thick or too thin either. Just like so, and then we'll heat that up. So this is what it looks like. Now I am ready to flip this. It should flip easily. There you go. So it's not dense and with the vinegar and the baking soda, it actually fluffs it up and gets it super nice and super, you'll see, it's like very fluffy. Great, so it is ready as you can see here. This is how it looks like and again it's not dense and it's really nice and fluffy inside and you actually don't taste the vinegar as well so I'll be showing you a whole bunch of batches that I'll be doing right now and the end result is really nice and light mmm nice and fluffy again <laughs> So, have your maple syrup with it, have it for breakfast, and let me know what you think. And thank you very much for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and bye-bye.